to look for what it's called and so what is this an ash gourd yeah and look at the ashy green mm -hmm. and gray colors mm -hmm. and it is smooth it is not fuzzy mm -hmm. it is smooth and it has a very thick skin mm -hmm. and you cannot use a, a peeler mm -hmm. to get the skin off it will take you years uh, so you had to do it and is it a foamy here like uh, yeah there is also foam and uh, that you... there's a soft layer mm -hmm. with all the seeds embedded there mm -hmm. is gone they took it away yeah that has been removed mm -hmm. and it is not unlike what you see in a cucumber or right. a squash and this is just a like a, a sixth of a, a big melon. How big? Oh yeah, this is a very small piece uh -huh. out of a huge uh, ovaloid. I can't see that. Yeah. About how big? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, squash. Right. And it is very big, uh, not as big as a... Uh, watermelon. Um, uh, watermelon. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it can get as big as some watermelons, mm -hmm. but not as big as uh, one of those huge pumpkins. Right. But. Uh, and then they sell it. They sell it mostly in slices yeah, like when this. When they sell it, it is usually not the whole, but it is cut up into quarters. Mm -hmm. And uh, in fact, it is sold just like this also in several mm -hmm. pieces. Right. And. That's why I wanted to show the yeah. original, uh, so they... Yeah, I'll uh, get, yeah. So that's the way it comes. Yeah. yeah it comes like this. In the fridge t section. Yeah. Okay. And this freezes well, we know that. When you oh yeah, it, it freezes well. Okay. Well, thank, thank you. you. Okay. I now you can cut this part, did she, for the meal. No, no, no. I, I...